what a wonderful way to start out the Blue Couch segment than by having Joel Dewberry here yes. with us. Thank you. Yes, <laughs> we just did a segment with him where we showed you how to make the adorable pin cushion from his book, what is Sewn it called? Sewn Spaces. <laughs> and so anyway, we um, are just thrilled to have him here, but we wanted to be able to interview him and find out some more things about what he does, why, where his inspiration comes from. Some of his and new fabric some lines. Some of his newest fabric yeah. lines, which is very exciting for us here. And for all of those of you who love fabric just as much as we do. So, welcome Joel to the book <laughs> Thank you guys, it's great to be here with you. <laughs> Thanks. And so, let's go ahead and get started by talking about your book. Yeah. That we just did the f fabric uh, pin cushion, the adorable the little bird, bird. Uh -huh. pin cushion sachet. And tell us a little bit more about why you put this book together. I'd love to. Well, Sewn Spaces was actually, my wife is a big component of this as well. And it was our vision to bring together different projects, mostly so, but some no so projects mm -hmm. that would reflect our personality and inspire others to reflect their own personality in their home, in their office, in their kids' playroom. And so it's a, a culmination of 25 projects that are very approachable. Uh, most are easy yeah. and um, just inspiring kind of creative thoughts on what you can do um, refurbishing old furniture or creating a bulletin board. Well, yeah, that is what I love about this book yeah. because it's not just about sewing a skirt or, or that kind of thing or just home decor. It is a collaboration of yes. all kinds of projects a very for your home. Book. I'm going to show you a few of my favorites oh, and maybe awesome. you can make a comment <laughs> on this. I love this modern tea applique because you not only applique with your beautiful fabrics here, but tell us what else you did here. Well, this is kind of a hybrid project. So it's taking fabric that, you know, some of your favorite pieces, um, embroidering them or appliquing them, and then um, I created a really simple technique for to kind of replicate screen printing. So it's basically yeah. stenciling, but yeah. with your own designs using a transparency and the fabric paint. And oh, wow. again, it's easy and it has a great kind of end, end result. Oh, yeah. I love Look the result. Look at this one with mm -hmm. the butterflies and then of course that stenciling technique. That t-shirt just looks so hip. I love it. And have it be known that all of the designs you've seen here are included as patterns, which you know, if you're not really creative, you can oh, use ours. That's, Even better. Yes. <laughs> Here's that another one that I love. This is a the farmer's tote, yes. farmer's market tote. Oh, it doesn't right. it just make you excited to yeah. go to the farmer's uh, yeah, market? Yeah, definitely looking forward to spring <laughs> and summer. I love this fabric line. What is that fabric? That is from the Deer Valley line, which was one of my favorites. And mm -hmm. kind of hidden in this damask is a deer kind of antler yeah. design, which um, right is there. fun for me to watch people not discover <laughs> it right off, but it's mm -hmm. kind of the second read. Yeah. Yeah. And, um, and then the design is rather simple, but in the end, with a, a really bold print like that, you kind of make a style statement. Yeah, absolutely. I think that's something that I really love about your fabrics is that they're classy, and they're, they, I love the bold colors that yeah. you use. Definitely. They definitely have the wow factor. And here's another one, the pocket memo board. <laughs> love it. Tell us about this. Well, we have four kids, and it's uh, you know <laughs> a challenge to keep uh, you know yeah. as organized. And so yeah. you know, this was uh, kind of a functional idea that we had. Okay, we need one for Brennan, one for Brooke, one for Kirsten, oh, yeah, one for Carson. And yeah. um, just a place to kind of put up, you know, important things happening in the week and sure. using fabric. So oh. you don't have to have a boring space or a cork board. It could be something beautiful. Well, it's yeah. like function meets fashion. That's right. Thank you you That's can great. put all those school notes in there and yeah. uh, permission <laughs> slips and all kinds of things as reminders. And it looks so good in your home as yeah. well. Thank you. Now tell us about your newest fabric line. Well, my, my most current that. line is the Aviary 2 line. Yes. And what we did, this is one colorway here called Granite, but what I did was I, we discontinued some of my first collections about a year and a half ago and continued to get new requests to have more of the line. And so we went back through all my designs over three or four collections and picked the best sellers. Mm. And it included things like the damask, mm -hmm. especially the sparrow print, oh, love the, um, sparrow print. the faux bois or the wood grain. And so Gorgeous. we culminated them together in a unique uh, collection called Aviary 2 and introduced three new colorways. Wow. So, so you've got the mm. gold and the gray and the yes. cream colorway. This is kind of our, our formal uh, color palette. Okay, mm -hmm. I will definitely be using this right away. Yep. We also have, you know, aqua, brown, orange um, called saffron, which Beautiful. is going to be really popular. Mm -hmm. And then we have what this quilt is made out of. Um, this oh, is our lilac take color look palette. look at this quilt. This oh. is gorgeous. And you designed this quilt. I did and my wife sewed it. So it's our, our <laughs> wow. team. Wow. Wow. This is just beautiful. Those colors and you just pop. 
You mentioned this is in, this is in your daughter's room, right? Yes. Well, it is. Um, we did a whole bedding ensemble, oh, um, wow. and this will actually be a free downloadable pattern on our blog. Fantastic! Wow. Tell everyone what your blog is. It's uh, joeldewberry.blogspot.com. That's I love about your blog is that uh, you've got the free patterns there. We get a little glimpse into your life mm -hmm. and your family's life, which is so fun yes. to see. This, of course, is free now on and the, so is this on Kim. his blog yes. and this. I think Look has to that. be one of my absolute favorites of yours. This is also a free design on your blog. That's correct. Right. Um, this is done in the modern meta line, um, and my wife was the um, <laughs> captain who put this together. I designed your, it. Your I wife is a gem, <laughs> because I don't know if you can tell, but this is hand quilted. Right. Wow. That says a lot That's about her. Gorgeous. Oh, I know. And the I think 17 hours it took her to do oh. it was... Um, I thought it was worth it, but so it was well a hard it. task. Isn't oh, that gorgeous? The, the results are just stunning. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, of course, the design is beautiful, but then you put in your, your gorgeous fabrics, and okay. it's definitely a thank winner. You. And it is yes. free at your blog. That's correct. That's wonderful. wonderful. Well, thank you so much for being a part of our show today. Yes. This has been so fun. I've enjoyed being here. Thank you for the invitation. You're, You're welcome. welcome. Thank you.